Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. Lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Through the answer to all of our prayers, Jesus Christ, your Son. Amen. Patriots, we are all holding the line. I know you are, I know I am, and all of the angels around us that are here on this plane and above are also assisting us in this time that is so completely razor edge sharp. I wanted to make this post today because for obvious reasons that it's inauguration day typically and that we are now on the verge of something that none of us could imagine in our wildest dreams to be coming to pass in our lifetimes. This is the reason why we came here. This is the reason why we are here. And this is the reason why we have suited up. We did not get dressed up for the nothingness that they are planning for us. And as we are in this moment in history that shall never be repeated, and that everything led up to this, all the battles, all the fights, all the wars, all of the delineations, all of the striving that were many pieces, many pieces in a mosaic of fighting for human sovereignty, personal human sovereignty, and for the liberties that have been put into place for us to express ourselves as the freedom that we are. This is the time, patriots, and we must be absolutely still at this point and know that God is in control. Wherever you are, wherever you may be in whatever time it is for you, this is God's time, and no one will dictate, no one will say, and no one can even know what it is that God has in store for us. What we do know is that nothing will stop what's coming. I don't have to tell you to prepare yourselves because you have. I don't have to tell you this is going to get rough because you know, and it already has. And I don't have to tell you that this is going to be something that is going to be remarkable in all ways. But I am here today to say I stand with you, fellow patriots, not just of our country, but of the world, because our president and our president reelect Donald J. Trump has stood for the world through standing for America. No matter what you see around you, no matter what they throw up for you to look at, you must remember your divine inheritance. You must remember what you are created out of, that there is nothing less for you than the will of God and the many mansions within his house that have been promised. It has been a very long battle, but we must stand firm and we must assert ourselves into the knowingness of that which truly is, not that which has been told to us, lied about to us, and hidden from us. And as God's will always gets done, we are now in the position more than ever to hold tightly to that which is calibrated to this will so that we too may have the most spectacular, optimal experience of what it is to walk in the light that we were created out of. I do solemnly swear that I will support and defend the Constitution of the United States of America against all enemies, foreign and domestic, that I will bear true faith and allegiance to the same, that I take this obligation freely without any mental reservation or purpose of evasion, and that I will well and faithfully discharge the duties of the citizenry of which I have been so blessed with, so help 
me God. Where we go one, we go all.